Yo, 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 what's going on? It's your boy Frank here from Truth No Chaser. And yes, you have entered another episode of Frankie Sports Bar, a place we can get your sip on and your weekly dose of sports all in one place. Yes, sir. This is the last call on Frankie Sports Bar. I got one topic to tackle today, just one topic and one topic only. But before I get into anything, I want to remind you guys to follow us all on our social media outlets. I want you to go to YouTube, Truth No Chaser. I want you to follow us on Facebook at Truth No Chaser. I want you to go to our website, www.thetruthnochaser.com. And I want you to follow us on Instagram at Truth underscore no underscore chaser. All right. So now that I got that all out the way, my topic that I want to talk about right now is that I told you so. I hate to be that dude to say I told you I'm lying. I love to be that dude to say I told you so. I told y'all so. I told you so. I told you. I told you we were not ready. Talking about football, baby. I told you we were not ready. We should not have started the season unless we had a legit system or a plan set in place like the NBA did. Look. Look and... And, 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 and what we're witnessing right now I can't say that I didn't see That th- th- this was coming You understand what I'm saying The Like I can't thank the NBA enough For really thinking the precautions through You know what I'm saying Taking the precautionary measures And thinking all, all It seems like they, 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 they covered all corners You understand what I'm saying The bubble was genius The punishments were stern and punitive The families and the, all parties involved For the most part were cooperative you understand what I'm saying? And I suggested a few sports bars back, uh, a, kind of like a bubble system for the NFL that could have possibly worked. But, you know, now here we are and the season is a pure mess, man. Look at the mess that we're in. man. You know, numbers are just rising steadily. Um, games being postponed, injuries left and right, production value down. I mean, just throw the whole season away, man, you know? Now, don't get me wrong. If it's on, I'm going to watch it. That's the sports fan in me. You understand what I'm saying? If it's on, I'm going to watch it. But I can't say that I did not see this, see this coming. And I, I didn't, at least my friends for a warning, you know, who am I to, you know? <laughs> you know, not that this is going to get to Goodell or anybody. You understand what I'm saying? And, but, you know, just this past weekend alone man it was just uh, just atrocious man look at it man see we had no quarterbacks eligible for the denver broncos right no quarterbacks all of them on the COVID list up to 18 players on the COVID list for baltimore for the ravens and and, and that's leading to more rescheduling we already had to reschedule we just needed leading to more rescheduled games and we got games being played on tuesday and shit like Santa Clara County in California, in the Bay Area, demanding a ban for all contact sports uh, that's professionally, collegiate, and youth. You know, so the 49 is a screw. You know what I'm saying? But instead, what we did, we rushed back, you know, the, the money hungry engines that they are, you know. Um, and I mentioned to a friend of mine, like, honestly, if it wasn't mandated, I don't think. You know, they would ever disclose the players' COVID results. I think the players would just be playing with it, and we wouldn't even know. You know, we wouldn't know who has it, who's at risk. None of that. None of that information would be uh, accessible to us. You know. <laughs> so you know, they fake try to get ahead of the curve with making themselves look productive by issuing these promos and staying safe and delays and reschedulings and stuff like that when the fact of the matter is if they really wanted to get ahead of the curve they should have had unless they had a legit plan like i said they should have just postponed the entire season till further notice you know but now look at every other week somebody's at risk um and it's just not it's, it's, it's it's fun to watch whoever's on the field but it's not turning out to be a fun season you know, every week is a mess. And that's just the real truth, no chaser, baby. You understand what I'm saying? So, 
Got to do it for Last Call on Frankie Sports Bar. Before I get out of here, I want to remind you that this episode was brought to you by Ambition Custom Apparel. Check them out for your customized clothing that represents you, your culture, and your organization. Ambition, go get it. Until next time, people, peace. Y'all be safe out there.